is mine. <laughs> yeah, probably. Mine is just crazy. Oh my god, I don't care about a McDonald's ad. <laughs> You're getting a McDonald's ad? I am. Hey everybody, it's me, Johnny Juicebox. Hey everybody, it's Mike Shake. And today, we're continuing what we started. <laughs> yeah, it's been a couple weeks. It's. It was, I think, I saw that it was July 24th. Is it really? Yeah, It's. it's been a while. It's been a few weeks. It's been a bit. And all right, we did the draft, and now it's time for us to play the game. Yeah. Now we haven't exactly decided on how we should be, which character we should be, but yeah, let's grab a coin. You got a coin? I can yeah. go get a coin. I can get a coin. Well, let's start the show, and we'll get some. Silent opening animatics. Also, this game is super unstable. Yeah, it's probably gonna crash. It's probably gonna crash a few times, and the way this works is if it cra is if it crashes, it's gonna stop the stream. So like, yeah, just we'll hang be, out. We'll just wait. We'll be jumping back in. Yep, just hang out. It has really good auto save functions. So yeah, and also this is SmackDown. Mike runs SmackDown. I do. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Can you guys feel the excitement? There's an electricity in the air. Hey, we have Corey Graves and uh, Michael Cole, time. I think. We're headed straight <laughs> toward the pay-per-view in tonight's in Rosemont, Illinois. It's proving ground for the men and we're women of WWE the pay -per -view. to see who truly <laughs> has what it takes. Yeah, I think we're uh, three weeks out from Money in the Bank. Is that what it is? I think so. Nice. And money in the bank is a thing in this. Okay. Like, you can... <laughs> oh, it's all of the great music and excitement. Yes. Well, let's start it. I love that you have... Oh, yeah. So, how do we determine this with the coin? I'll... I'll uh, I think heads is should be Brett, and then tails should be uh, Randy. Well, do you want to flip the first one? Sure. Oh. So we'll have heads on the left and then tails on the right. Sure. For all of them, and then we'll take turns flipping coins. Oh, I lost it. <laughs> it went. You flipped the coin and it went straight behind you. Damn it! <laughs> it's in the couch. I got it. <laughs> okay. Oh, I haven't flipped a coin in a long ass time. <laughs> okay, it is tails. Did all you right. call it? No, you. We said... Oh, alright. So, so I'm Randy. Randy. Alright. Okay. I'll be Brett the Hitman Heart. Hi, Norm. How's it going, Norm? There's so much excitement in the air. I know, right? Oh, we get Brett the Hitman Heart and we don't even have his music. <laughs> I, I don't even know his music. The, the best there is, the is best there ever will be. And is for the WWE Universal <laughs> Championship. Making his way to the ring, representing the Hart Foundation from Calgary, Alberta, Canada. Weighing in at Calgary. 235 pounds. Brett the Hitman. Was the anvil originally from uh, Calgary the too? The anvil? Yeah. No. 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 The best technician no. Ever. I don't even think he was Canadian. Huh. So he must have met his sister yeah. through him. Then, yeah. After they already started the working together. Oh yeah. Byron, are you ready for the madness? Oh, you know it. Or oh yeah. Oh yeah, Michael. <laughs> <laughs> Snap into a Slim Jim. <laughs> oh, yeah. Weighing <laughs> in at 239 pounds, Macho Man Randy Savage. 
<laughs> one of the all-time greats, truly a once-in-a-lifetime talent. Oh, the man. Macho Man. That's awesome. I mean, he used to be a former baseball player. Really? Yeah, he played for the Cincinnati Reds. What the shit? Yeah. He was a shortstop. There's only one Macho Man. So he wasn't very good, No. <laughs> I mean, he made the majors. The personification of unrivaled yeah, intensity. And Being a short man, stuff Randy in Savage, league is like as intense as uh -huh. It's very hard to succeed. Yeah. I think there's not a there's not like a lot you can do. Nope. Or a lot, not a lot of success you get. Nobody cares about the short stuff. Ah. <laughs> Am I wrong? Uh, they're very important. They are, but nobody cares about them. It's kind of like O linemen. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Technically, they're the most important position uh -huh. out there, but like. Nobody values them. Right. <laughs> right. It's a universal championship seen by many. And now as the this is to determine who's going to be the SmackDown champion. Yes. Entertainment. Whether we're going to get Macho Man or Bret Hart. Being the universal champion always carries a lot of distractions. A lot you know, of responsibilities I forgot to what it was. The champ needs not worry about anything else than what's in front of him. He up high. He paid for that one. Oh, man. Big time. <laughs> Oh, I think I really locked just up the ref. <laughs> I can't do that in this one, Johnny. Not well, I did. Huh? I did. I locked up the ref. He gets kicked off with authority. All right. Big cross body. Savage lured him in there. I've never played this one, so this is. Uh, and Brett gets countered. There he goes, right into the corner. Man, Jesus. <laughs> Big close line. Oh, come on. <laughs> oh, a right oh, hand for counter. defense. He moved, but can he capitalize? I think that would have hit something. Hi, Sino. Hey, Sino. How's it going? <laughs> oh, over and over. Are you excited to watch corner. some wrestling? <laughs> Aren't you excited to watch some wrestling? Over and a revered champion. What are those things attributed to? It's Rand's <laughs> unrelenting commitment to formulating a strategy. By the time the bell rings, seven hey, I am not good at way to make uh, fighting games, so I'm just gonna. Throw that out there. Oh my God, what a cross body. Here's the pin. And I'm the also line. not good at this game. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't go well if you still can't. Oh, I think I'm, I'm bleeding. Count by now. Ooh. God damn it. I locked onto the ref again. <laughs> Hart gets out of it. Lands the cross body. Here's the pin. <laughs> One count. It's only because I kind of caught you off guard. Like, yeah, like last, uh, the other night when we were playing, I caught you off guard at the end. Also, this game is janky as shit, so... Johnny, I'm, I'm trying not to. <laughs> John's gonna get a, he's gonna get disqualified from a championship match. <laughs> oh, so it'll be exactly like the era these guys were fighting, where everyone's constantly just disqualified, and nobody actually has to win anything. <laughs> It's like, oh, looks like they set Hulk Hogan's beard on fire with a camera. <laughs> I guess we can't have an actual match this time. He's a projectile now. Lift off. Good lord. Taken flight. That's gravity taking a break before coming down like thunder. <laughs> Oh, yeah, because you can only get it through pinfall or submission, right? I think so. Four. Close line. Oh, Lord. So a 
match and we just put it to like <laughs> double double DQ. <laughs> He'll take things into the ring. Johnny! What? I'm just throwing him away. Like look at his eye here, folks. <laughs> Show those suits. Yeah. Damn right. Screw those suits. With the axe Nobody <laughs> likes Corey Graves. Ooh, right to Michael Cole's he okay. He needs to get himself some Jesus, Mike. What? Fast. Get my ass beat? Again? How do you have two finishers and I don't have one? Neither have I. The madness may be on empty. Savage could be done. Savage load him in there. Hulk gets out of there. Here's Savage sent flying. <laughs> Climbing up to the top now. To the sky. What? Big time rift pays off. The daredevil in you comes out when you <laughs> Clear out. Easier said than done. They are not concerned about anyone else's well-being. He's begging him to get up so he can put him back down. Four. <laughs> Five. He's really slowly getting up. Six. He's lining him up. He's testing fate here in danger of a count out. Eight. We'll slide back in the ring there now. There we go. <laughs> oh, foot just stomping down. I'm going to you, ref. I love how they're, like, you know, legitimately famous refs in WWE. Uh huh. And they just oh, grab the like a, a random yeah like, rando dude right, but like they could have licensed the guys. They, they could have. Fuck the man, man. <laughs> 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 Ooh, <laughs> oh, Nightbot started up again. Oh boy. <laughs> See what I mean by this game's kind of janky. Uh huh. <laughs> this game's kind of janky. <laughs> Cinder block. Two. Yeah, everyone needs to get out of the way. He shoves him onto the announce table. Aww. Looking to end this in <laughs> fashion. Close line. What impact. Into the ring now. I don't even think that counts. Well, Mike, you have two finishers. I know. I've been getting my ass beat. I guess so. Brett lining him up from the top turnbuckle. Plus, I, if I remember right, Randy Savage's finishes are weird. It's like, you have to be up on the turnbuckle to use him. Like, it has a lot more specific, uh... Oh, there he goes. <laughs> oh, and I missed. This is the worst thing I've ever seen in the at the end of his career. Come on, right? Oh, man, I want to do top. like. Look out below! <laughs> There's absolutely no apprehension to putting one's body <laughs> on the line. I wanted to be able to do like one of those Kofi jumps. Right? Like, just 50 fucking feet. 
Uh -oh, oh, this shit. is going to be bad. <laughs> really bad. Woo! This could get prickly. Uh -oh. oh, yeah. Holy oh, shit. Nothing can withstand the savagery <laughs> of these competitors. I like how the count table. stops this during that. <laughs> right? There is no limit to the destruction we can see here tonight. This, this has become so a monumental much. struggle for these competitors. It is down. Oh. Oh. The, the, oh, the Looks like Brett's, Brett Hart yeah. is your champion. He's now. the champ. Brett Hart is the champion of SmackDown. Well, I think that may be the biggest win of that young man's career. I don't know. Not to agree with you, Carl, <laughs> an incredible victory. Yeah, I mean, a hard fought matchup. Yeah, that's oh. a great show. Oh, oh my god, look at Macho Man's face! <laughs> Gotta love it. <laughs> How old is Bret Hart now? He's like in his 60s, isn't he? Oh right? yeah! This young man. Alright! Oh, I think you have control of this. Next. Can't even go down. Oh, I can. Why did it do that? I don't know. All right, now it's my turn. There you go. All right, let's see. Heads, I am the fiend. All right. They didn't even give Bret Hart the championship in that. That was weird. That was weird. Huh. I don't know. I don't get it. Maybe the ref was just pissed because I hit him so many you times. You did. You hit him a lot. <laughs> you should have got disqualified. Eh, it was enough in between, I think. <laughs> yes, because they both have game controllers on their chest. Yes, he has a game controller on their chest. Because <laughs> that's <laughs> how, you, how you select them. <laughs> Smart ass. <laughs> Oh wait, they're behind. So oh, so he was talking about. It, they were talking about it because uh, uh, it was blacked out. Oh, I see. <laughs> uh, Big Show, the Giant. He has a, Paul White. He's got like a um, yeah, his name's Paul White. And yep. He's got a, a a sitcom on Netflix now. Yep. I think it got canceled. It though. did. Oh, well, look at this. All the, all the trailers I saw for it, it looked alright. Yeah. The Fiend with no music. That's okay. <laughs> oh, I can see. That'd be funny if just nobody comes out. Oh, God, if it just glitches out and the whole thing crashes. Oh, the... F Bray Wyatt. We miss you. Yep. Wyndham Rotunda. Yep. That's IRS's son, isn't it? It is. <laughs> it sure is. He did. Did Tom Savini work on that mask? He sure did. Really? Yeah. That's a. And yes, yes, he did. <laughs> I always thought like Bray Wyatt, the no. Fiend's mask is really cool. Yeah. I can't believe Boogeyman went undrafted. <laughs> <laughs> surprised you didn't draft him. I'm surprised you didn't. You got the Fiend. He would have matched up with the Fiend. He would have. Really cool. Although, I would have tag-teamed him with Papa Shango yeah. if I drafted him. Man, everything here is weird without music. This is so odd. It turns out wrestling entrances are really dumb. <laughs> it's just the music that makes them huh? cool. <laughs> Gotta have the music. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah it is.
A part of me was hoping Mike would do a run-in and just start beating the shit out of me. <laughs> <laughs> I love that night bite saying, Remember you are loved. The asylum loves you. Okay. That's okay. Good thing neither of us drafted Elias, because Elias' intro oh. is like 10 minutes long. God. He sits down, he plays a set. <laughs> and we all get to sit there and watch Elias sit on a stool and, his opponent and play and sing Tampa a song Florida, to everybody. Weighing in at 430 <laughs> pounds. The Giants! You are looking at some highly motivated competitors in this match, looking to steal the show and capture the attention Did of the Did they say entire nothing during, WWE universe. during the Fiend's entrance? Nothing. That's fucking weird. I mean, there wasn't... I mean, there wasn't anything. Paul White's here. A man who always considers himself main event material, an uncrowned champion. He wants his, to show exactly what I don't know what the Giants tonight. music was, but Big Show had... Show as he hated show. like, like you said, he hated that music. He did. Yeah. He hated the uh, Big Show music. Yeah. 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 It wasn't great. No. And never seemed to match his character well. It sounds kind of like we have a superstar with a big chip on his shoulder. He has certainly been overlooked recently. Well, he has a chance to change that perception in this matchup. Yeah, but he's staring at someone who's shown a lot of hustle to be in this spot. Oh, Whether he's studying tape or spending extra time at the PC, he expected this challenge and is ready off for it. Rough start here. The Fiend? They make the Fiend look really chunky. Don't they? Oh, yeah. Fat. Good night. But he's not like that. Big like time. No. He rocks his opponent. He's bigger, but he ain't fat. Like, he's a big guy, but he's not, like, that big. You know? Yeah, Big he Show is, like, 7'1". <laughs> uh -huh. In real life. That's fucking huge. What's he gonna do? From the top. Oh. landing. <laughs> Fair, I think they weigh him. Yeah. Well, no, that's not true. For a while, uh, Big Show was considered the largest athlete, the uh, largest working athlete on Earth, because he was, I think, seven. He's taking some good Like seven and like seven uh, zero and a half. Yeah. And like 520 pounds. He was huge. He's fucking huge. And did you see those pictures of him now that he's retired? Oh, is he's it just did, ripped? Did he lose weight? Oh my god, he's got like a six pack now. Does he? Yes. Good for, good for him. He has that. He had that uh, thing that uh, overactive pituitary gland. He had to have surgery. He had to have brain surgery. Oh. Yeah, I'm. I'm struggling with this he's one. Got Jesus. There we go. I've never played as this character. Too. Um, also, it's a created character, so he might be janky. Good night. Or, I'm, as I said earlier, I'm also not going to use games of games. And I wasn't joking. Stirring back to his feet. Johnny. <laughs> You're going to reverse this. I fucked up the reversal. Jesus. How do you come back from that? Oh come on, a one count? Bullshit. Oh, this game is such bullshit. <laughs> this game is bullshit. There's no truth in this art. <laughs> Shitty wrestling game that they put out in three months. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking bullshit. Look at this raw power. Like there it's hard enough for them to make this game not crash, let alone function like a game. Looking for a little bit of high risk here, it seems. Flying. Sorry, Bray. 
I thought I was gonna oh, make it for a second, but he just he just couldn't. <laughs> oh my God! His is Big Show is just so again. fucking huge. He's being steadfast in his approach. <laughs> yeah, you know, now that I think about it, though, what? like I think Bray Wyatt was like three something. Oh, he's a big dude. Yeah. So that means that Big Show almost doubles his weight. <laughs> well, that's just disrespect right there. I kind of like it. The only person I can think of who is heavier than Big Show as far as build weight is Yokozuna, who yeah. was built at 600. Can they go on the attack? Not only that, but I mean, you had... Uh, Which I don't think is true because compared. he does not look like a 600-pound man. Right. Well, he could he could maybe be 500, but I think 600 is pushing. That's his go-to move. Can he finish this off? Oh, come on! Jesus Christ! You can't just end the match immediately. I mean, and it may just take going to the one more time for that effort to gain the pinfall. Every ounce of momentum is now against him. He's being right now. Just constantly on the ground. That's just disrespect right there. I kind of like it. Oh! They just clip through each other, right? This match grinding him down. This is basically a perfect victory for you. <laughs> yeah, watch me lose. That'd be awesome. Dude, there are some characters that are just difficult to fucking play as. Like, remember uh, the other night when we were playing, where I was playing as uh, Sergeant Slaughter? Yeah. That did not last long. No, well, it was a brawl, so I told it was. you it wasn't going to last super long. But, and we were Mr. T, though. Mr. T is good in brawling situations. Probably. You know, I probably should have paid attention to it. But... <laughs> Just a regular match. Yeah. I'm bleeding. Back in the ring now. Oh. Back in the back in the net. Net. He is just reeling from that offense. <laughs> He's considered cold. It's not a bad condition. I can't really say much match. about that. Oh, come on. That's some fucking cheese you can reverse a finisher. Come on. Yeah, but it's harder to reverse a finisher. And they do it on the show, like the actual shows all the time. Do they? Yeah. Where it's like, oh, they're going to do the 619. Oh, no. Setting up. Oh. 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 <laughs> God damn it, giant. Makes him pay with a counter. <laughs> showing they've done their homework. <laughs> what the hell was that? What the fuck? <laughs> there they go. If this works, it could change the course of the match. From the top. Yeah. Nobody holds. <laughs> <laughs> fuck you, ref. <laughs> He's able to sidestep there. Jokes. And he's keeping the pressure on. Yeah, he's firing on uh, all cylinders. <laughs> I like how he gets up like the Undertaker. He does get up like the Undertaker. These are both creative characters. They're, well, they're real, but they're, they're CAWs. Yeah. They call them. He's going for the pin. This could be it. Damn it. Oh, son of a bitch! So hey, we at least brought it up to a three-star match. Right? Or at least people will be like, this is fine. 
<laughs> this is fine. Jesus. They shouldn't, though. They should be like, please stop this. <laughs> it's like that Roman Reigns Goldberg match. Because they aren't originally in the game. They're real people, but uh, they weren't included in the game. <laughs> so uh, we downloaded them. I don't, it's not really weird, it's just they Bray Wyatt got released from WWE a while back. Alright! Finally! <laughs> it's over! <laughs> this fucking massacre is over! God, it's like a fucking nightmare. What a battle, oh, man. Respect to both competitors. He was. He was, and then he got released. And this I love. This I absolutely love. Yeah, he was. Uh, he should have taken a page out of He that. was in a stable Let's with uh, career, Alexa Corey. Bliss, I think. What's that? Great Alexa Bliss. Yeah. The yeah, she was Sister family. Abigail. Yeah, Sister Abigail. Well, I kind of matched them up together. I know that Giant's much bigger, but Giant. When he started WCW, he was he was always like a creepy guy. Yeah. Yeah. He was like weird. Yeah. Neither of them have any allies or enemies. I'll create that sometime. <laughs> Maybe. Oh shit, how should we do this? Let's just be on one tag team. Oh, we well, what tag team should we be? Iconics. <laughs> All right. All right. Yeah, he was he was created. And the giant uh, Big Show retired. He did, and then he joined AEW, and, and now he's he going to be Captain AEW. Insano. So, he'll probably be in that AEW game, maybe. I would imagine. I'm looking forward to that game. I'd like to check it out. I just wish there was a way to watch AEW without having cable. I know. Because I don't have cable. Right. So I can't watch AEW. There's got to be some way. I think if you get the TBS streaming service. Oh. Oh, that's right. You don't have a Roku. No, Shit. I don't. Oh. What? I'm missing an intro. The following contest. <laughs> I don't it's like the <laughs> No? no. For one fall Why not? On the way know. to the ring, Billy Kay and Peyton Royce, the Iconics. A duo that has showcased the very best in tag team wrestling tonight. Looking to be another one Were they for the highlight reel. who? Carmella. <laughs> <laughs> what a team. What a team. Carmella just got X'd at a house show. And I think uh, Peyton Royce just announced her pregnancy. Really? Yeah. The Iconics aren't aren't in WWE anymore. Oh, they're in TNA. Yeah. <laughs> oh, look at the stuff without the music. Yeah. See? yeah, Roku's are cheap as shit, too. You say that, but every time I've seen them, they look really expensive. They're only 30 bucks. Yeah, but you have to, you have to service them. You have from to Norwich, service. England. Hey. What? Don't play for a service for Roku. Already reaching a fever pitch upon no. their arrival, and we are just oh, seconds oh. away from a highly anticipated match. This could be Paige. Oh, there's Carmella. With no reward. <laughs> Woo! The WWE Tag Team Division is more competitive than ever. As Who's these two teams Who's... get into it, I can almost guarantee this match. How do I get out of the ring? The standards for tag team action just keep getting higher and higher around here. Shit! <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> I'm sorry, I fucked this. God damn it! The fuck, John? John, really? 
You're gonna fucking purposely do this shit to mine, so you can win. What do you mean, so I can win? We were on the same team! I mean, in terms of the fucking shows! <laughs> Son of a bitch! Well, so much for that. Sorry. <laughs> what should we do? I don't know. Same team? Yeah. I'll be Hogan. Alright, well, I'll be Trish Stratus. <laughs> That fucking thing was bad, dude. Yeah, I got one star. One star it, dude. <laughs> Son of a bitch. To be fair, I don't know who they were counting. I don't. It must have been me because I kept trying to get out of the ring, but that, but everybody else was in the way. Hey, it's the nature. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Introducing first. From Charlotte, North Carolina, weighing in at 245 pounds. That's Charlotte the Flair's dad. Yep. Boy, <clears throat> Flair. He's been married like seven times. A lot of times. Byron, that yeah. is sacrilege. The fact that you were trying to imitate Ric Flair. I think that guy was wearing a You would a know shotzi. nothing about this man's what? lifestyle. Was he? Nothing. I There's a guy in the learn. crowd, I no. think he was wearing a Shotzi shirt. I think you drafted Shotzi, though. Oh, I totally did. Yeah, because... <coughs> oh, no. She she didn't make it into the, the match today. Oh. But she is going to fight a match against Natalia. Oh, today? Yeah. Oh, you already have them all picked out? What? You have them already all picked out? The matches? Yeah. Yeah, because neither of them uh, made it into the ladder match okay. for the championship. Okay. Look who's here! So they're fighting to see who's and in ninth place in the division. Moscow, the Ravishing Russian, Lana! This is a very I, random I, matchup. I know nothing about Lana. Neither do I. <laughs> of his spinneroony from Lana. I actually heard the same thing. I'm going to double check with my sources and get some verification on that. Well, well, tell me you guys didn't know. just Pretty say that. I soon Discovery Plus Byron, isn't going to exist anymore. Who? Discovery Plus. From Lana. I know. She could probably help you out. And Lana, neither is HBO Max. Incredibly talented. Nope, it will be In together. The They're going to be making an entirely new app WWE. because fuck everything. She is ready for this big match. What is Lego like watching on uh, Discovery Plus? Zach Baggins? Zach Douchebaggin. <laughs> the third man has arrived. The undisputed the leader of the new world order. And ghost hunting in general. From Hollywood, California, weighing in at 302 pounds, Hollywood Hogan! I don't know, I'm just too pissed off at Discovery this right man now. Changed sports I don't blame you. History on July 7th, 1996. Weird oh, bullshit. <laughs> Weird, oh, crazy Hogan people bullshit. WCW, his Hulkamaniacs, and all of his allies to form the New World Order. <laughs> what is this clip? <laughs> Is that a clip? Yeah. Is that for unmatched our show? Up, yeah. <laughs> thanks, Cino. You know. uh, yeah, thanks Hollywood for the clips. Wild on you. <laughs> was that of us fucking up that I Yes, <laughs> yes it was. <laughs> Just remember, I'm a wild card when it comes to tag teams, so... Oh, boy. Trish Stratus. She's considered like one of the greatest of all time, isn't she? Yep. From Toronto, Ontario, Canada. Stratus Khan. 
From a manager to a groundbreaking competitor, you cannot talk about the greats in the women's division without talking about Trish Stratus. Yeah. And all yeah. the opponents leave the same way, stratified. You know, without the music, you get to hear the crowd a lot more. You and do. Like, the crowd is great and terrible at the same time. Too bad we can't have the music. Yeah, it is too bad, but you know, whatever. Whatever. Hogan's just gonna keep on that at bandana. Tag team rules here as we start off with. Does he Rick usually not fight the bandana? And no. And across the really? ring we see Hollywood Hogan. disqualification. If those rules apply to us, <laughs> I'd tag Cole and get you out of here. But wait, I'm on oh, Mars no. and Michael's team. That's what you think. Flair did his home. Ooh, man. What a counter by Hogan. Brutal for him. He's absorbed some damage already. What are you doing out there, John? I'm all right. Just beating the shit out of Lana. Oh, thanks for the sub, uh, Cino. Yeah, Cino, thanks for the subs. He saw that one coming. Don't worry, I'll keep her away. <clears throat> really? I did not know that. I didn't know that. Face crusher. She returns the favor there. Looks ruthless striking. And are you guys going to do your, um, your, uh, Stardew uh, Valley streams? Yeah, when are we going to do Stardew again? <laughs> oh, start oh, the adventures Alright. Scooped up top of I just realized that the next episode of uh of Skyrim Flames of War is gonna be episode twenty. Is that right? Yeah. <laughs> Fucking serious, a goddamn uh, a computer fucking reverse my shit. <laughs> Johnny, do you want to get in this match or you want to be outside? I mean, I'm pretty much in this match. Look at this. And I've been I've been fighting this whole time. <laughs> Not like I'm not doing anything. Such an underhand. Here he goes for the win. Oh. Going for something else, it seems. Lana out of harm's way. Step up for the side. Get him, Hogan. He's got the answer for that one. Dropped him with a big shoulder tackle. I'm stunned and on the ground. Oh, no. You flare. Now is not the time to bask in disbelief. Now is the time to find that second win. Find that rush of adrenaline to push you forward. Able to get the advantage here. I love just love that wall of text.
Oh. <laughs> all the way out there. Out the bet. Okay. The figure four. Flair going to make his opponent submit. Nate with the figure four in. There's the save. There How close was that? <laughs> Thanks, John. <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> do you need, do you need to tag me in? <laughs> there you go! Have some fun! John! What? Oh no, this could be really bad. Yeah, distract him. Great job refocusing to reverse that. Shut right out of the ring. Uh, okay. Blast <laughs> off. It doesn't matter if you're on the outside of the ring. There is no place safe Come when you on. face such a risk taker. Hogan might have just ended this one. She goes under the ropes and back in the ring. Shoulders down. Could she finally put this away? Start. There we go. Good job, John. Woo! Here are your winners. Wait, that's not Hogan and Trish Stratus. <laughs> and it's Trish Stratus finishing this one off for the team. Very nice. Really putting the sports in sports. I just love when Ric Flair is in a match. I'm really just constantly here. Uh -huh. Woo! Uh, it's so dumb. Amazing! Huh. Well, that's good. At least somebody liked it. Alright. Let's flip that coin. Who's. Here, who's... flip it out, Johnny. Yeah? You're better than I am. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Where'd it go? Uh, it hit the ceiling, I know that. It's heads. All right. So I'll be Luna. I'll be Bam Bam Bigelow. What? <laughs> no. He's just a manager in this one. But I get Bam Bam. I want to be Bam Bam. <laughs> you didn't draft Bam Bam. I did not. I I was almost. I certain. wanted to draft everybody, Johnny, but I couldn't. I know. <clears throat> I felt the same way. <sighs> Man, I want alphabet soup. Do you? No. That is not very good soup, John. I know. Like, my brain is like, yeah, that's good. And then I know if you eat it, you're like, oh, this is so uh -huh. good. It's like it's SpaghettiOs. Like, I was literally just, you took the words right out of my mouth. Like, oh, SpaghettiOs are so good, and you eat them, and you're like, this is like, this has no flavor whatsoever. None. none. <laughs> literally none. None. And it's like, how did they do this? Cane? <laughs> <laughs> what? Have you never played as her? No, I haven't. Is scheduled for one I've never fall. played as Luna Vachon. Making her way here. to the ring, accompanied by the Beast from Canada, Low The Beast from Noah. the East. Gentlemen, I think this one's gonna. Low Noah. What? <laughs> what have we downloaded here? I, I mean. I downloaded like the one this good looking Luna Vachon. Uh -huh. We downloaded for the for the model, not tonight. for the not for like what they call her on the game. Kane. <laughs> Kane. And from Milan, Italy, the All American Beth Shoot Phoenix. Away. I mean, I guess Beth Phoenix is close enough to Wonder Boys. That's Beth Phoenix! Yeah. I can't see. What? That's what the side said. <laughs> you can't see me. 
Who is she going against in your your timeline of WrestleMania? Oh, she's a. Uh, I think that next Raw she's fighting Leilani Kai. Well, they say they always say that the next week the like it's gonna be like some women's yeah. division match, but it's never in the actual oh. show. That's nice. <clears throat> Respect the work this superstar has been putting from the top. I'm <laughs> surprised you didn't do that, Johnny. I was trying to pull you down before you did anything. I just want to beat up Bam Bam. Look at him. <laughs> Look at him. He turns it right around with a counter. Into the turnbuckle. Oh, the ref in the wrong place there. The ref's got to be better than that. Sorry, I'm getting tangled up in everything else. <laughs> uh, what a counter. Alright. Woo! Man, all those eight man ladder matches are gonna be great. They are gonna be so long. Okay with that. Give the people some nice quality content. Yes. Just one step ahead. on the shoulders. A backbreaker now. She's starting to look concerned. She can withstand the punishment, though. From the top. Wow, she oh. lands hard. She drops a plumbing blow. She'll get sent out the hard way. Looking to take flight here. Perched up top. Woo. You gotta be kidding me. All right. Just crashing down the top. Yay. Uh. <laughs> Made her pay for her mistake. <laughs> Flipping senton, that was nice. I don't know why we decided to she do this way. She was clearly waiting for that. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, close line. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just stay out here. I'm, I cannot get up off the ground. <laughs> she wants to take this one outside the ring, it seems. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Fuck, man. <laughs> oh, my God. You know, Alundra Blaze is actually, like... She's a manager on, a, on NXT now. Of this back and forth. Insecurity finds its mark. <laughs> and surely she hears how high the referee's count has gotten at this point. Well, if she does, maybe she just doesn't care. <laughs> and just like that, he's <laughs> oh, That poor rub. Look at Bam Bam. I don't think he's ever smiled in his life. What? He was smiling out there. Was he? Yeah. The beast from the east? Gonna take. And the gear finds its mark. The other problem is I have no idea like, where I have to be for my finishers to right. my end. Dirty pin? What is a dirty pin? Just casually yeah, stop the count. You. Obviously has more in mind for her. Shoulders down. Cover away. Oh, 
<laughs> all right. Dirty pin. All sorts of trouble here. Apparently, the ref didn't catch it. Right to the kidneys. Oh no, my kidneys. Oh no, my other kidneys. You can certainly do it. The cover. One, two, one. Oh. Have to wonder what more does she have left? We have reached a whole. Panzer's not much. I can't get up off the ground right now. There we go. And we're out. <laughs> we were going on again. Yep, we're out. Right. And now she's climbing to the top turnbuckle. Drop kick. Right there. And up the turnbuckles we go. From the top. And she doesn't connect. Oh, close oh. Ooh, this is All right. Time. <laughs> I love how like low rated this match is right now. I don't get it. Even more at this point. She has to fight back quickly here. Maybe it's because we just keep clotheslining each other over maybe. and over again. God damn it. Kiss my ass. <laughs> Shoots up the top rope. Dangerous thinking. And the top. The gun. And that's a bad landing. That is what happens when you throw your body around. Jesus. <laughs> He's going for it. This could be. You must have lost your control there, eh? Uh, I, I missed the button. <laughs> I figured. I was like, oh, there, there was a miss of an X there. Uh, Yeah. 
Penny, what is your finisher? I don't know. I have no idea how to use it. What is that? What is that? The thing that's above my name. I don't know. I don't know what that is. I think it's an injury thing. Oh, I'm hurt. Might be injured. She avoids the attack completely. Is that the thing that can happen? People can get injured from this. Saw it coming and got out of it. Running close line. Flipping sent on attack. Looking for the victory. There's two. There's some shock in the arena after that kick out. I can't figure out her, her finisher. Not doing kick up, <laughs> kip ups. <laughs> Just giving up in the clotheslines. I think it's done. Uh, I almost had it. I almost, almost had it. American That was a good match. Yeah. This one felt special for the moment the bell. Three and a half he stars. Knew it was going to be a show. He had really lived up to all. <laughs> out of ten? Huh? Out of ten? Out of out of five. Nobody does out of ten. <laughs> it was great. That was better than great. Was, yeah, they they really like went up really slowly on that one. Alright, what are we doing? I don't know. I think I'll be I'm, the outsiders. I'm a B I'm a B Eric Bischoff. <laughs> okay. All right. No, I'll 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 play. What do you want to be? You want to be big be, sexy? Hall? I'll Stinger? Be a Sting. Yeah? Let's play against each other. We haven't played a tag against sure. each other. So I'll be Sting. I'll be Scott. All right. Recipe Scott. Oh. I don't know a lot about him, but I heard he was a very nice man. Yep. Even though he was on a lot of drugs throughout his life. He was. <laughs> yeah, that used to be the main event mafia in TNA. Who, Sting and... Sting, uh, Samoa Joe, Kurt Angle. Kurt Angle was in TNA? Yeah. Huh. Um, who else? Uh, Booker T, Scotty Steiner. Huh. What is... Oh, there we go. <laughs> Look at him go. Look at Bischoff. Uh, fusion dance. <laughs> He's scheduled for one fall. I wonder On if the they based the fusion, the fusion dance off of that. I don't know. 608 pounds. <laughs> Scott Hall and Kevin Nash. The The We're new looking world at some order. of the most intense competitors in all of WWE about to take part in one of the most anticipated <laughs> matches Love it. ever. The reason Hulk Hogan. I just did like that how Eric shirts. Bischoff just literally went through Hogan there. Did you see that? <laughs> oh, it's fine. Where's six? I don't know. You can have up to three managers come out. I don't know. I drafted six, didn't I? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. He just didn't come out this time. It's not. He didn't show up today. <laughs> Al Thorpe. <laughs> <laughs> we can create our own music, right? We our own music.
I'm sorry, but this almost feels like a squash match where they're just like, all right, NWO comes out, and then they're like, who's going against them? Oh, it's Sting and Samoa Joe. <laughs> And their opponents first. Holy shit, he's got From a baseball bat. Damn right he does. Weighing in at two. He always has a ball bat. I know, but I'm surprised that like that wasn't they were able to do that. I don't know. Stays the course. They've overcome some tough situations, and I admire that. <laughs> So what? Everyone gets dealt a tough hand from time to time, but you have to know when to fold. Well, knowing this person, I don't think you'll get your. I think it was Scott Hall that actually created that uh, that mask for Sting. Really? Yeah. He That's said you should watch The Crow, and you should face paint your your face like that. So he <laughs> did, and so he watched The Crow, and he did his face paint like yep. that. Thanks to Scotty Hall. And it's been that way forever. Yep. Yep, since 97. Jesus. Yep. <laughs> He's pretty old now. A He's very so high pressure situation Steve Borden? For this guy, huh? he is Steve Borden? Uh -huh. for yeah. You know who I miss? Doink the Clown. <laughs> you know who I miss more? Dink. Dink. Dink and Doink. <laughs> oh, this is going to be and good. From Huntington Beach, California. Weighing in at 282 pounds. I miss pounds. Hornswoggle, too. So yeah? Yeah. I liked him a lot when I was a kid. A man who lives his life wanting to prove to the world that he's the best. <laughs> I just love his, his Joe TNA bits. Joe's going to kill you. <laughs> uh, be careful, Saxton. If you're not, Joe might also take your seat at the well, commentary the, table. Joe's going to kill you. <laughs> That's what I call an upgrade. They still do that. Because I, I think that was a, there was a, a match that Rhea Ripley did, and the crowd was chanting, Rhea's gonna kill <laughs> you. <laughs> and they did it on the game, they do it with Shotzi a lot. Oh, yeah? They chant, Shotzi's gonna kill you. Okay. I don't think they do that in real life, because... Yeah. They, they've been doing Shotzi dirty lately. And the bell is wrong. Getting All right, this never played started. Started. When you think of tag teams that are itching to make an impact on tonight's event, you don't have to look any further than these two. Two teams with a desire to steal the show. Actually finds the mark. <laughs> I like how Kevin Nash is just knocked right? out in the middle of the ring right now. Draped across the top rope. Hey, Samoa Tag Joe, I think, I think I need to make a switch. Yeah! <laughs> Dude, Samoa Joe's broken as shit. It's always really hard to fight against. Damn. Are you Joe? Yeah. Yeah. From the top, oh, misses the mark. Jesus. Looking for a high risk move. Which is really, Kevin. First up top. Oh, no. Uh, <laughs> goodness, that did not go as planned. I guess Samoa Joe just can't. Plan to begin with. An elusive match there. No wonder this is a one star Can match so far. <laughs> Across the top row. Overhand connects. Uh. <laughs> Punch lands. Oh. 
Punchlands. Jesus. Using his body as a weapon. Oh, a <laughs> and Nash expected that. Oh, big sexy. Well. <laughs> Probably wasn't the right choice to do Samoa Joe. Oh, what the fuck? Uh oh, get ready to drop that bow. <clears throat> oh, Is this just a so normal match? I think so. Let me double check. Stairs, but heading up, he's thinking back. Uh oh, oh my God, what a move. man, that was really parked up that I like just oh, shit. control. How like Kevin Nash came in and I just immediately punched him, right? All right, Sting, let's go. Sting's finishers either. Scorpion Deathlock. Nasty kick. Scorpion Deathlock. Hanging back with their own count. There's the heel kick. Turning the tables. Reversal on top of reversal. Shit run. Placed in the corner. Reversal. Can he take advantage? He's ejected from the ring. All the way to the right side. Take it out from high above. You gotta be some special kind of crazy to do that. Shoulder tackle. Dominating shoulder tackle. Very good. Oh, Dodge is out of that. Alright. Now at least Sting is getting some hits in. Because that's Hogan. Get the fuck out of here. He's in a little bit of trouble now. I love how Hogan yeah, showed up to be like, I'm gonna beat up Sting. Kick to the gut. This is very WCW match, huh? Bad intentions coming with his hole. Because he got Sting. It's the abdominal stretch. Grabbing the ankle for extra torque. Ooh. Oh, Short right. elbows. <laughs> and a hit toss to the stick. Oh, come on. Climbing oh, I'm top. stunned. <laughs> Big time. Here we go. Oh, just completely off target there. What? Look at how much matter you put what in the You just have blinded. it. Get him, Hogan. Three. <laughs> <laughs> Into the barricade. No! 
He may be in a bad way here. This is what the purpose of a tag team is. Don't be afraid to use the resources and help your partner offers. Oh, the razor's edge? Damn right. No. Outsider's edge. All might have just All right, Tino. What the hell? What? They couldn't even pin ya. <laughs> All right, Tino. Have a good one, bud. All right. <laughs> Not even a one. Jesus. Oh man, Kevin Nash is gonna wreck my shit. <laughs> He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Kevin Nash isn't a top rope guy, is he? No. And he's seven feet tall. Taking a chance and it didn't pay off. I can't. Oh, fuck. Samoa Joe. <laughs> Loser. Fuck. Incredible. And he gets the tag. Awesome. Got the tag. Right Jesus. Now you're stunned again. <laughs> huh. Flipping centaur. Beautiful centaur. He's on his heels a bit now. These two teams have gone to war, Cole. Of course they're going to wind up with a few battle scars. Oh, Wait, battle scars? Yeah, Who's bleeding? Attitude behind it. I guess I locked on to Eric. When you dive ringside, really just laying it in. And a double axe handle smash. Oh, fuck. I am not. I, I don't know if I can win this. Nash, are going to close this one out. Jesus. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> the New World Order. <laughs> John's like, New World Order. <laughs> New World Order. Harden, I can't see how you get a better tag team victory than you just saw there. That was nice. Get out of here. <laughs> no love loss between these two teams. That's Jesus. Cool. That's a big number of Yeah. So painful. Jeez. <laughs> the damage has been done. Clearly on a mission here. <laughs> what a match. Look at that. Big rivalry. Enemies, Eric Bischoff. No, that's that's that that was Scott Hall. Scott Hall's enemies are Kevin Nash and Eric. <laughs> Why? I don't know. Why? His his enemies are his tag team partner and his manager. <laughs> oh shit. And 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 Kevin Nash's enemies are Scott Hall and Hulk Hogan. Wow. Who the fuck is that? Is that like Karrion Cross? I think so. <laughs> I don't know why. It's not even in this league. I think this is Allie Boyd now. Is it? Yeah. Ooh. Are you. you Go ahead, do it, one? Johnny. Why don't you flip it? It's your turn. I flipped the last one. Ah. All right. 
Ouch. Allie Boyd does not exist. I made. Yep. I made her. All right, that's heads. All right, so I'll be Allie Boyd. Ah. All right. Huh. <sighs> Man, this is going to be quite the match. Allie Boyd is 6-7. <laughs> yep. This is my brutality. <laughs> now the nightmare is real. Rash. Bold and unashamed. Whoa. Brutality has arrived. <laughs> the following contest <laughs> is a last woman standing. What is our main event? Making her way mean? to the ring. Huh? What do you mean? Adelaide, what is our main Australia. event? What is our main event? It is Owen Hart versus Yoko. Oh, that's right. The first ever woman to hold the NXT UK Championship. Has gone on to hold the end. Uh oh, she's here. Uh. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, this is extremely. No, this is last man standing, I think. So, how does that work for this game? Last man standing? Yeah. There, it's no pins. Huh? Just knock them down. And then the ref, like, counts them out. So, how do you lock them down? For the fate of heart. You're on the ground right now, and then the ref's gonna count. For I assume. The ring. Why isn't the ref counting? Oh boy, oh. it's a baseball bat. Hoping to ref, why aren't you counting? One big swing, and it is getting downright nastier and nastier with each of these attacks. Oh. This doesn't even look like trying to win a match anymore. This looks like trying to end oh, someone's God. career. It's deep, and I don't think it's playable. And agile escape catches the kick. <laughs> I think we have to get in the ring for it to officially start. I don't know, they just had that awesome last man standing match with uh, with Brock Lesnar and Roman Reigns. Right? And I never thought I would say that. Carefully measuring their opponents. There's the ref takes a blow. She's getting something from under the ring. Like she's got the sledgehammer. Can someone please take ah. it away from the ref? Whoops. Oh, man, the ref needs to get out of the way. The ref How much bigger you are than me. You're going to have to do it because it just keeps coming. This is getting more and more alarming with each uninterrupted attack. This has to be stopped. The cumulative damage here there is go. going to have long-term effects. That means it's starting? I think so. Yeah, because I noticed I got rid of my gear. I think so. Well, that's what it was for uh, Rock and Roman Reigns, wasn't it? Yeah. I'm just trying to make sure I have the And it is clear the mission now is to destroy the incapacity. Yeah, you have to hit X in the thing to get up. Okay. Perseverance. And things are just going from bad to worse. Woo! Producing a trampling. One, two, three. <laughs> and 
this match will complete. Jesus. Man, if only I could grab a tractor and pull up the ring. Right? Should be the best. But the thing about it is that you can't, they don't count while uh, while you're hitting them. And she's up. There we go. She's going to keep fighting. She saw it coming. Holy shit. shit. Are you kidding me? Incredible. And that'll stop the count. This match continues on. This one is headed outside, guys. Right, what do we got? Man, there are no tables. Oh, boy. Come on. Not the chair. Oh, oh, chair the ribs. Chair. Just one. Completely throw off your equilibrium. This is getting more and more alarming with each uninterrupted attack. She heads out of the ring. Interesting uh, strategy. Uh, and oh, count outs me. She has the whole outside to play with. Uh, Taking out the arm. Great strategy. Oh, just in case the first few didn't hurt. There's another. Taking this match off the mat. And somehow, somehow, she breaks the count. Just a tremendous amount of heart on display in this matchup. Shit. Beats the ten count. All right. Going to push on through the match. Well scattered by Ripley. Rights and lefts, elbows, knees, all of them lethal. After what we've seen so far, you cannot question the race these superstars are willing to go. The limits of physical exhaustion are being surpassed at this point. <laughs> Safe. <laughs> oh no, get oh, her out of shit. here. Get her away from here. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> Woo! Tables. Jesus. Yeah. Oh my god. I can't believe I'm I am at a loss for the words right now, truly. Oh my god. <laughs> I think it I think the game decided you're done. <laughs> Oh, I'm so mad at this. I'm sorry. Still climbing. We're up to seven now. Eight. Have you ever won one of these? No. That's the count. Shit. Oh. Last man standing match. <laughs> what a match. Though. Here is your winner, Hunter Ali Boyd. She earns the <laughs> W against fierce competition. We are I like that she has like bones and shit hanging off her pants. She does. Just that. I think that's a horseshoe. God Some damn keys, that maybe? fucking power bomb to the. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that was that was all she wrote. Yeah. Like I, nobody could <laughs> no. nobody could hit that. Nope. So I was like, ah, the game decided that this is done. <laughs> decided we're done here. Oh, yeah, this one. Extreme rules with Ghostface and Scott Steiner. <laughs> All right, Johnny, do the flip. All right. It is Tails. Tails. So I will be Ghostface. Oh. All right. Ghost face. Well, while this loads, I'm gonna go pee. You can thank Atomic Sino for having ghost face. Yes. <laughs> Atomic Sino chose ghost face. He did. Yep. Uh, you want to drink? 
I would like some water. Thank you. Uh, whatever. So, hope everyone's having fun today. Because we are. After this, we're going to be doing Raw, where I have a series of eight-person ladder matches. <laughs> there are six eight person ladder matches that are going to be happening to determine who's going to be the champion for each one so we'll see how that goes hopefully the game doesn't crash but it might and that's that's just a thing we'll have to live with then I wonder who's streaming right now. Besides us, I mean. Let's see. Oh, Kara's streaming. Hmm. All right. Well, what is happening, John? Huh? Nothing. Nothing's happening. I'm waiting. Oh, I could have. Hey, it's Sav. Hi, Sav. Thanks for the bits, Sav. How are you doing? <laughs> Scott Steiner. His nephew is in NXT right now. You finished your book? That's awesome. Little Sav finished your book. We, I thought we got raided because all of a sudden we jumped five people. Did you step on your controller? The following contest oh, it, is it an was like, you want to skip this? <laughs> Making his way to the ring from Detroit, Michigan. Weighing in at 282 pounds. Freakzilla. Scott what? Steiner. Freakzilla. With this level of talent showing called? their skills, this is why I do what I do. Clearly not expecting this. <laughs> I cannot believe what I am hearing right now. Why would he come out here? <laughs> Why do you think, Zach, that these two can't stand one another? Just menacingly <laughs> walk towards the <laughs> mat. <laughs> what if this is Extreme Rules? Yeah. No such thing. Just menacingly and walk with a baseball like bat and then no just get your just shit raw rock. power and straight up anarchy. It takes a certain kind of superstar to thrive in the chaotic atmosphere of extreme rules. Tables. You can light tables on fire in extreme rules matches. Having a couple of screws loose, as long as they're not damaged. Myself working alongside you two. There's certainly an element of danger inherent in a no disqualification match, isn't there, Corey? Oh, damn it. People realize it's not just the superstar in the ring you have to worry about. You have to worry about everyone in the locker room that they're aligned with. The odds in this match can swing with or against you so fast. Please stop hitting me. Unpacks a well-placed punch. Gets him with the counter. What a punch. He's getting a little better now. Not everyone's cut out for extreme rules. Maybe he wasn't ready. If you press circle, I think you can throw me through it. Wait, did they just... Is that is... it? 
What the fuck? I thought I won! No. They... Oh, god damn it! That's not how Extreme World Rules matches work. I know, that's, that's what I was wondering. What the hell? You know, this match is sadder than I thought it would be. <laughs> Absolutely no telling what's underneath the ring tonight. It is ghost face. Remember, Sino, you picked Ghostface for the, uh... Yeah, you Smackdown. picked him for me! Well, I mean... He's in, uh... He's in... He's in the WWE, so, like, the steroids kind of make sense. My knee right between the shoulders. I wonder if we can go... Behind the stage in this. Aw. No. Not in this arena. I wonder what Ghostface's signature is. I have no idea. He's starting to struggle here. In order to succeed in an extreme rules match, you have to be willing to sacrifice your body a bit, guys. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> you know, this kind of passes for the screen movies, though. I feel like Ghostface is always is always like on his on his face in those movies. He's getting his shit rocked by somebody. Oh come on! <laughs> I don't know. Because I have a finisher, but nothing's popping up, so I'm wondering if it's a flying finisher. God damn it. <laughs> what, what Mori? Take a selfie? <laughs> Isn't that what, uh, what he does yeah. in Dead by Daylight? Yeah. You see, he takes a selfie. Uh huh. Oh, so he's like Theory. Yep. That terrible, terrible character. Soon he may too. He can really stand to get back as good this as he's getting is he's right a about now. Bag and he takes selfies with uh -oh, everyone he beats. Is... Oh. He may get the <laughs> Why? Here. Does it have to be in the ring? It's hard to, believe, to count it out? Like yeah. Still yeah. Some okay. gas left in the tank. Oh, let's fuck that ref up. Uh oh, he's searching yeah. for something. Um, get enough of it's a table. Dude. I'm not sure what he's scheming, but it can't be good. Oh, the referee, the unfortunate victim of that. They're the table. There we go. Oh <laughs> bench presses with the ref. <laughs> Why did you, how did you let that on fire? If you do it right when you bring it out, it can't be damaged at all. Like it can't be roughed up at all. And he heads out of the ring, no count outs, no worries. Oh, bench press with the... <laughs> the ref again! Oh man, the ref needs to get out of the way. He's positioning himself. Closing oh. in. I think the crowd knows what's about to see. That's it? And Terror keeps mounting on him. Super punch. He's being faced with adversity here. Two. One. 
Oh, oh you have resiliency. That's a, that means you automatically break out of it. He's fighting uh, Scott Steiner. Scott Steiner. famous wrestler. Yep. He just got inducted into the Hall of Fame this year. He did? Actually, both of them did. Yeah, the same and he's British. taking this yeah. to the outside now. Oh, look, fire. I gotta go through the fire. I mean, someone's gotta go through outside the fire. Outside of the ring now. What's the plan here? Absolutely no telling what's see. underneath the ring tonight. Sledgehammer. Oh no, that's sledgehammer. <laughs> what is that? Right here's the pump handle. Oh. <laughs> Welcome back, Cino, by the way. Yes. Thanks for being able to evade. I mean, that makes sense. Why it's like, who was that in real life? In that oh, the oh, the damage is I bet. Kind. I bet. I bet in some way. I think he got put through a few things on fire. Uh -huh. <laughs> but it looks like his end is near. <laughs> I must have just put it in a terrible place. His eyes are Good job, John. He's looking to end this. I don't know. Maybe it'll Staggering work better if you do it. Speed, but okay. he won't like what's coming next. Either way, we can just have a flagging table for a, for a backdrop. No one can survive this much. This is just getting uncomfortable at this point. Oh, there we are just going from bad to worse. And worse than this place. Well, it was fun while it lasted. Yep. And the referee gets caught in the line of fire. Comes back into the ring. Uh-oh, this is not going to end well. All right. You can see as he rises how vulnerable of a man they need to see the Steiner recliner. Uh, here we go. Suplex. Holy shit! <laughs> Is that his special? I don't know. <laughs> oh my god! Not as close. It was almost a no sell. <laughs> His beating it's fucking Ming out here. It's one of my favorites is when they like no sell a big finisher. <laughs> See if that works. I don't think we can light it on fire again. Oh! There we go. Woo! Man, this is a problem because I can't see anything. <laughs> Throw that rough to the fucking. Ah, oh, come on! That's the problem with having it in the middle of the ring is like everything bounces, so it just knocks the table over constantly. The advantage now is squarely in his corner. Yeah, he's fulfilling his game plan to the team. <laughs> If he was looking for an opportunity to pull a 180, that could be it. Oh. Uh oh. Jesus. <laughs> he skirts around it. And set it up. Oh, he is. That's going to hurt. Able to avoid any harm there. Oh, man, taking it to the trachea. He's setting it. The table's on fire! It's in a fire extinguisher! Pretty 
sure they plan to make the competition the fire extinguisher tonight, Saxton. <laughs> Oh, uh, dang it, Johnny. That's how you stop your opponent. Just benching ghost face. That is supporting it here. Oh man, I don't know if I'll be able to. <laughs> A one count. I'm shaking my head in disbelief over how he We're both dying out so here. Unbelievable. <laughs> I love when people run into each other like that. There's something about the way Go Is there something about Ghostface mask when he looks up at you, it looks like he's begging you not to hurt him. <laughs> Oh, I'm oh. done. No oh chance. Oh my god, that was such a sudden ending. Wow. Uh. Here is your winner, the Ghost. This is the type of victory where you're Look really at that. The They're yelling Memphis. at each other and shit. I don't know if I'd say the battle scars were worth it, Cole, uh. but I will say the one who did it to them isn't the one celebrating right now. Oh, wow. that's a big rivalry. Is it? Wow. I guess it's a rivalry now. I mean, we set fire. We set tables on fire. That's a that's a thing. Yep. Ooh, the big one. There it is. Okay. Tails. All right. Last match of the night. <laughs> For SmackDown. Mm hmm. I don't know if we'll do that week two today. We'll see. <laughs> <laughs> Those fucking eight man ladder matches are gonna last hours. It's gonna be so cool. Is it? <laughs> Maybe. It's probably gonna crash quite a bit. I'm surprised it hasn't crashed like while we're playing just normal matches. Hey everybody, it's Owen Hart. The following contest. Rest in peace, is Owen Hart. For one fall. Making his way to the ring from New York, weighing in at two hundred and twenty-six pounds. He ain't from New York. Is he not? So Canada. Huh. Take a look at the talent in competition here. You can see exactly why the WWE universe is so amped up for this one. Yeah, because he would be from Calgary, right? Huh? From Calgary. Yeah, he's from the same place as Bret Hart. They yeah. grew up together. There's something up with his nose. He's got a beak in this game. Yeah. Doesn't matter where or when he's competing, this guy just wants to fight. And he's about to get one. And that's not untrue. What? Where he's like, it doesn't matter where he is, he just wants to fight. Uh huh. And here's a Samoan guy. We told you it was Japanese. <laughs> yep. And his opponent from the land of the rising sun, weighing in at 558 pounds, <laughs> Yokozuna. What makes Yokozuna so scary is his ability to use his massive frame or surprising agility to earn the win in any situation. Well, that ability Corey has earned Yokozuna. Man, he died way too young. Did. 
like Brett the Hitman. He was Hart, only like 36 or something. Hogan, yep. And The Undertaker. That doesn't really look much like him, though. Not really. Where's Mr. Fuji? Mr. Fuji's not in the game. I wonder if we can download Mr. Fuji. I imagine you can. Johnny, you can find everybody under the sun in this game. It's not 100% true. There are a few we couldn't find. Oh, Wrath? Yeah, we didn't find a good Wrath. We found a few Wraths, but none of them were like awful. They were terrible. Um... Is this a regular match? I think so. I think so. We can double check. I think it is. This superstar is coming Here, I'll, in. I'll double check. Yeah. With a lot of enthusiasm and energy right now. But what's going to happen yeah. when the excitement wears off? And he comes to the he's in a fight against someone looking to take his head off. All I can say is we've seen adrenaline take this superstar very far in the past. But across the ring is a practically unstoppable behemoth, Yokozuna. An imposing competitor. I like that he's hard to knock down, though. Because that was one of the things that was made a big deal about with Yokozuna. Where they're like, never knocked down. Until Lex Luger body slammed him and uh, On a fucking carrier. On the carrier, yeah. So <laughs> what? <laughs> Great officiating as the ref noticed he was on the ropes. This is right for him. Now he's been put on the defensive. Incoming! Sight set on the top rope. From the top! I feel like wrestling is more athletic the nowadays. Of the sure. There is no place safe when you, you say that's right? At times. I mean, it's more mainstream than it was back when. I guess. Much more. Ooh. He would have hit his head on that. On the. He would have died again. I forgot about the count. <laughs> Back break. That's a weird thing to do. That used to be a big thing. Really? Uh huh. I thought the eye rake was a big. Eye rake, back rake. I want to see him body slam Yokozuna through the table. Ooh. Oh, oh, and hard. Wouldn't that be a DQ? Huh? Would that not, would that not be a DQ? Uh, not in this. Because remember that first match that threw Randy Savage through the table? Oh, that's true. As long as it's within the time count, it doesn't matter. You can also throw people into the into the posts and shit. Young Ozuna gets reversed. He's open to start a rush of his own with that attack. <laughs> Referee's count only getting higher. Come on, gotta get back in the ring. I love that I learned how to do that. Right? 
count. That's literally just like when you when you do the pin, but you're standing. He breaks the pin before a one count. Still in it. Not even a one count. Oh my god. Just lifting him up, Johnny. Ah, got that boot up against his face. Quick count out after one. Hey, at least That's the one count. Taking the one to catch your breath. This could be the beginning of the end. Oh. The shot center is locked in. <laughs> Are you serious? I beat you. I beat you in the, in the thing. The sharpshooter. The sharp sharpshooter, Yokozuna. Come on. Kiss my ass. Just goes to show you, you got to be on your toes at all times. Wow. Great. Man, people were not a... People. No, I can't imagine why. Like, Jesus Christ, that sucked. <laughs> At least we got to see that crazy ghost face match. Yeah, that was a good uh, good show. Yeah, they lit a bunch of stuff on fire and things. <gasps> oh my God. We have to edit this. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. As much fun as Freddy versus Kofi Kingston seems. I mean, that seems amazing. <laughs> Amazing, dude. Yeah. That's not a rivalry that's happening right now. <laughs> Sorry, guys. All right. Now, who we're going to start with is we're going to have Bobby Lashley and Sheamus. Johnny's already, he's already picked out everything. Yeah. Everything. You want to help me find Sheamus? Sure. Bobby Lashley. Uh, yeah, Xavier Woods isn't his manager. Bobby Lashley doesn't need a manager. All right. Sorry, Sino. Sorry, Sino. We're we are still going to have a Freddy match, though. And we are still going to have a Freddy match. It's just not that one. Because I'm going to make this match a Freddy match. But first, we're going to have eight man ladder matches for. <laughs> Unbelievable. Alright, this first one is going to be. We'll make this first one be for the US championship. Okay, so who are we have it in here? We need Sami Zayn, Adam Bomb, Giant Gonzalez, Mace, Rikishi, Papa Shango, Finn Balor, who's the demon Finn Balor. So you're gonna have to repeat all of them again. Once I get to them. Giant Gonzalez. Right, I'm under D, so I'll go to Demon Finn Balor. Okay. Who else? Adam Bomb. I'll look for Sami Zayn. 
Okay, who else? Um, Rikishi. I'll look for Mace. Who else? John? Batman and... Oh my god, Batman. <laughs> uh, Papa Shango's the last one. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I didn't know that they had a Bruce Wayne. <laughs> and it's a championship for the, for the US championship. Holy shit. <laughs> Is this the right United States Championship? Alright. I think so. <laughs> Alright. All right, and for this one, we'll be doing. Huh. Ladder four-way tag. How does that work? I don't know. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> um. Well, I guess we could do the women's tag. So. So, who well, am I teaming you, up with? You look for the Bella Twins. What's her, their first names? Uh, Bree and Nikki? Okay. No, not for that one. Oh. Well, how the hell do I know? <laughs> well, this is a tag team, John. Well, I guess we could do it for this one. But, like... This one needs to be Madison dead. So, which one is, are we doing over here? Uh, do make that one the Bella Twins. Are you sure? Yeah. What's the other B Bella? Nikki? Yeah, and it should, because I have them set up as tag teams. So. Okay. Who the fuck is this one? Oh, it's Raquel Gonzalez and Karma. There she is. And it's a title match for the <laughs> Women's Tag Team Championship. Oh boy. <laughs> Fun a minute. <laughs> and this is going to be oh, wait. What? This is Freddy versus Iron Sheik. Oh. We're gonna make it extreme rules. Because uh. <laughs> Freddy should be in extreme rules. Sure. Plus, we need Charlotte Flair and Nyla Rose to be, you know. Uh huh. Ooh, a backstage brawl, though. Uh. Let's do that. Sure. And who is us? Uh, Freddy and Iron Sheik. Wait, why are... He has a second attire? Yeah. Hmm. They're just gonna brawl it out. <laughs> In Freddy's boiler room. <coughs> hey, Jay! Hey, Jay! How's it going? We're setting up for the, for the next one.
for the next show for Raw. <laughs> We gotta change that matchup. Oh my god, another eight man! Stop complaining. <laughs> what is this one? Um, this will be the women's championship. Okay. So we need. Oh fuck, we needed Naomi, and I think she was in there. Um. Naomi and Mandy Rose. Um, Tamina Reckoning. Oh. <laughs> okay, Reckoning. Um, Cora Jade, Nikki Cross. Which one? Oh, whatever. Okay. Um, Nikki Cross, Saray, and Stephanie McMahon. Oh, okay. And Nikki Cross. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Title match. This is for the women's U.S. championship. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm glad you're here. Uh, yeah. That women's U.S. championship. Man, it's a lazy Sunday. It is. Um, let's see. Next, let's <laughs> do the men's tag team championship. All right. <laughs> Four way tag. All right. So we have the Usos, the Street Profits. So Street Profits, The Thieves. Oh. oh, you're doing the Usos there? Sure. Okay, so what am I doing over here? There's the Street Profits. Okay, and what are their names? Uh, there's Angelo Dawkins. Taz, Montez Ford. Okay. That's his name. Alright, I'll do these guys over here then. It's Vader Ta! <laughs> but it's not. It's not. It's not at all. John Cena and Logan Paul. Oh, God. Because that's a tag team we've got going now. Uh, uh, which one is this one? Um, This, we're looking for Repo Man and the Joker. Alright, I'll get the Joker. Oh, yeah, I'm right here. Because, you know, you picked the Joker for us, so we decided to make him a tag team with Repo Man. <laughs> I wasn't 100% sure what to do with him. And I, my lovely fiance Savannah, decided to, decided to uh, make me pick the hell Logan Paul. Uh, what? I didn't see him. Is he under the? Hang on, X out. No. 
Yeah, there he is. Oh, fuck. Here, pick him. Because <laughs> since they're set up as tag teams in the in the system, if sure. you select one of them, and when you go to select the next one, it auto-picks that person. <coughs> <laughs> Yep. And that's for the Raw Tag Team Championship. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, next. We have to pick between... Um, oh yeah, we're going to have that... Uh, Oh, Riddle and Randy Orton. I, nobody picked Riddle. <laughs> right? Huh. Alright. This one is going to be a one-on-one. -on -one. Um, sure. Extreme Rules. Okay, who we, we have in here? It's uh, Shotzi versus Natalia. Who do you have? I'll do, uh, Natalia. Alright. Ah, ha, ha. Sav. <laughs> Smartass. <clears throat> Honestly, they're ladder matches, and neither of us are great at these, so no. there's no telling who's gonna win any of these matches. <laughs> Man, they got, like, the whole Hurt Business going. Alright. Another eight man? Yes. Nice. We have two more for the championship. Holy and the championship. shit. <laughs> you know what we're doing here. <laughs> you, you can't act like you're surprised, because I already told you what I have planned for this. Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Nope, this is just a ladder match. All righty, who are we going to have now? Um, well, what should be the main event, do you think? The women's or the men's? I don't know. We already have the men here. Let's and go for men, then. One of them, like, Roman Reigns is already is one of them. Okay. So, we need Seth Rollins from 2020... Because I don't have... I don't have the other one. Okay, I'll get him then. I need Drew McIntyre. Okay. Um... Edge and Randy Orton. Well, since I'm close to Randy. Okay. Who else? Um... Rey Mysterio. I'll get Rey. Which one? Just the regular one? Uh, yeah. Just okay. the regular one. Let's see. Kofi Kingston, Roman Reigns. And who else? I'm confused. I'm missing someone. Hang on. <coughs> Alright, we got... Oh, AJ Styles. Okay. <coughs> All right. Oh my god, that would be such a fucking match. Right? <laughs> they would never do that in real life. Never. Like this is the whole fucking this is the whole team. Yep. This is all of our main guys. Nobody will want to watch anything else. <laughs> I think it's this one. <laughs> Set to make the greatest... The greatest episode of 
raw ever. <laughs> ever. All right. And this is the women's championship. And yep. we have Becky Lynch and Charlotte Flair. Oh, good Charlotte. We got Nyla Rose, Asuka. You said Asuka? Asuka, Nyla Rose. Okay, who else? Um... Alexa Bliss. Alrighty, I'll get her. Which one? The regular or 21? Uh, the 21. Okay. I think is the one that I got. <clears throat> Io Shirai. Okay. Nikita Lyons. And Beth Phoenix. Nice. Oh, good path. All right. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to be starting this around 216. We'll see how long she goes. <laughs> <laughs> um, is it this one? I guess so. 